Hello, it's Lisa again. Today I'm here with another haul. We went school supply shopping at Dollarama and then what we couldn't find there, we bought at Walmart. So I have a school supply haul for you today. I have two kids going to school. One of them in grade two and the other one in kindergarten. So this is what they needed for school. We needed Kleenex which we got from the dollar store. I will, in the video, put the prices up at the top of the screen there for what each item costed. So yes, we got two, three boxes of Kleenex. Then they needed Ziploc bags. Yeah, those are markers Levi has. Then they needed Ziploc bags to put like, they needed extra clothes in Ziploc bags and we don't have any so I bought like an extra box for us to put their clothes and stuff in for school. Then Eli needed a one pack of Play-Doh, two packs of 12 pencils. One pencil sharpener. Oh yes, Eli needed pom poms. So there is a craft kit. I'll take the eyeballs and the uh, what are these pipe cleaners out for us and send the pom poms to school. Um, three packs of four glue sticks. pack of 24 crayons, two packs of three erasers, a pack of white glue, twenty-four pencil crayons, these twelve Small markers. Oh Levi, can you bring me those markers over there? And a pack of 10 markers. And that's all we got from the dollar store. And I believe the total was around $50. And what we needed that we couldn't find at the dollar store was a duotang. A yellow, specifically yellow duotang. So. And these Hillroy note pad notebooks that they are very specific about what kinds and stuff. So we got two yellow, two green, two red, and a blue. And the most expensive part of school supplies, we needed indoor running shoes for both of them. So Eli got the Minecraft ones that light up. And Enya got, what is this, Frozen, that also light up. <laughs> so then also they needed specifically the shoes to be Velcro, they can't have laces. Which I feel like, are we teaching a generation of kids how not to tie shoes? I guess I might have to do that on my own time. And then Enya needed headphones and I wanted to get her something that was not from the dollar store because I feel like for certain things you just have to spend a little bit more money on. So these I got from Walmart as well. They're uh, Disney whatever this is again, I forget. Frozen headphones. And those were I think 24 bucks. I'll put it on the screen like everything else. We also bought a can opener at dollar store and like a little catch ball toy. So. We spent $47 at Dollarama, and we spent $99, 97 like $100 at Walmart. So in total, we spent $150 on school supplies, which I feel like is pretty decent. Uh, let me know what you think about that. <laughs> Prices for school supplies. Are you, have you guys already shopped for school supplies? Are you waiting? Last year we waited way too late and then it was like chaos so I wanted to get it done early and I'm 
happy that that's all dealt with and we're ready for school. So thanks for watching. I will see you again tomorrow. Bye.